You know, tonight we're on the eve of engraving and unveiling 96 new names on our granite panels. Inside each one of those names is a story. There's a story that only many of you can tell. We picked this day so that you, Gold Star families, can know that this Saturday belongs to you. The Gold Star community is thankfully small, but amazingly mighty. And together we heal, together we grow, and together we understand the dangers of war. When I walked in the room, they knew that my life had changed forever. In the Army, we love to talk about lessons learned. <laughs> and I learned that I could either be bitter or grateful, but I couldn't be both. So instead of being bitter about my circumstances, I chose and continued to choose to be grateful for the time that I was able to spend with Ryan. Each died for a cause he considered more important than his own life. Let us pledge to do our utmost to carry out what must have been their wish that no other generation will have to share their experiences and repeat their sacrifices. When a soldier, sailor, airman, or marine falls in battle, the impact of their loss is not just felt by the immediate family. The impact is felt across generations. Their names, now etched in the granite, on one of the memorial's eight plaques joined the nearly 7,000 soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines that have given their life in defense of this nation since September 11, 2001. Today we honor all of them. This memorial ensures that they are honored not just today, but always.